defects module. Defects tracking is done at defects module. It is used to keep all data related to defects. Defects can be added at any stage. Defects can be added at test lab module while running a test case. It can be done by clicking on the new defect button in defects module. Also we can add defects by importing from an Excel. The various functionalities the various functionalities that can be done in a defects module are create a defect, modify a defect, email a defect, link a defect, add defect to favorites. Let's look at them one at a time. Let's create a defect for the defect detected earlier in the Yahoo search script in Cardi Center in the defects module. Click the new defects button. The new defect dialog box is shown. In the summary field, enter a short summary of the defect. In the detected by field, enter the ID of the person who has detected the defect. You can set the priority of defect from emergency to severity 3. Let's say it's a severity 2 defect. Since the defect is newly created, the status is obviously new. The project team is the same as used while log on. Specify the test client on which the testing was done, the type of work, these are the various fields associated with the defect, maybe the requirement release assign, the actual completion date, the test data details, the project identification number, uh, if the defect is modified or not. The developer ID, whether the defix is reportable or not, and production date. In the description, you can uh, write in length about the defect to make it comprehensible to the developer. Click submit. A new defect is created with ID 4940. As shown here. The next functionality that you can do is modify a defect. Say suppose you want to change the defect from severity level 2 to emergency. Double click on the defect. The defect details dialog box is shown. Change the severity from level 2 to emergency. Click OK.